Hi guys, welcome back to Enigma Review. So today is going to be a little bit different video and I'll explain briefly why. So I am outside at the minute. Um, natural light. Uh, my front room is absolutely jam-packed with boxes. My conservatory is in the middle of being painted. Um, apart from my kitchen, I thought it's very dark in my kitchen, there's no natural light. So I thought, let's do it outside, why not? So we've got two items today, guys. One that's come from a familiar um, small independent business that I jump into quite a lot. Um, I am going to be having a break from buying anything, guys. So the last couple of things you're going to see on my video, which are Halloween related, will be the, the last things you'll see on my channel for a little while. I have got some old videos that are still in queuing, um, basically because Halloween's come and Halloween's come first. So anyway. If you recognize this, yay! So it's the amazing Hannah Horror, um, and she's a dark illustration artist. Zach is in the tent outside of me, so if you do hear him, I, I, I apologize. Zach, shh, listen. Zach is going to be going back to school soon, so while he's here, he's just enjoying a bit of chill time. So, one item in here is for Zach, which I'm going to put in the frame later on today and pack it with the rest of my Hannah Horror items. There's a wasp coming. <laughs> and one is for me, which is to go with my collection. There is a few more that I want to get. She's just brought out Loki. Well, bugger me, I've got to have Loki. So I might buy that. I think it's part of a Halloween collection, which is not, she's not, she's give a sneaky little previews. And we're like, oh, I like that, I like that. But she's not actually said yet. So both come in pinstripe, Beetlejuice style um, paper bags, which you should be familiar now with. Um... Oh, sugar. That's the only thing we're going to struggle with today, guys. We're going to get blown away. <laughs> so she puts it in the hardback kind of cardboard envelope. And then she put, thank you so much, Rachel. We hope you love your spooky order. And then she's got her information at the back. And it's um, Instagram at Hannah.horror, Twitter at HannahHorror underscore, and then at Facebook it's HannahHorror. And she's got her Gmail on there and it's HannahHorror at gmail.com. If you ever want to query anything, or you can find her on Facebook or any other social media platforms. If you want to get that information, pause it now, get your information down. And then at the front it just says thank you. So thank you, Hannah. And then and at the front it says no tears please it's a waste of good suffering i've already got two of these so i won't be putting this in the frame again because i'll have too many of the things but these are great to put into frames as well guys and yeah add it to your gothy wall of decor so i've got a pair of scissors there so i'll just let's have a look at zach's one first guys because i think this one's absolutely amazing so zach is obsessed with a band called ghost um, me and Ben have not really been interested in that band but now we've started to listen to it more because Zach's always playing it. We actually like Ghost and yeah, we love it. So we decided to order a picture for Zach which will go on my wall as well but it's Zach's picture and he can see it when it's there. I don't think I really want to put it in his bedroom in case he says I don't like it, it's scaring me. But it's Papa! Oh, and there goes my bag. In the stripy bag also Hannah Horror has her logo which is here and this is definitely a hannah horror style this is done on fuji color crystal paper guys so it's like photographic paper very hard wearing i love it i'm going to try and put it back in the envelope i don't want it getting dirty and that was um eight pound guys so it's eight pounds for an a4 unless it's something really snazzy and new and her prices are usually around about the same, so £8 for your A4 and £5 for your A5 sizes. And I do think her smaller prints, I don't know if they're £5 for her quotes. There we go. And then, here is my one. Again, you've got the Hannah Horror logo on there in the stripy paper. I've not opened it yet, but Ben opens that so you can have a look at it. And then this one is to go with my last 
Yay! Oh no, it's a different one. I'm thinking of a different one. So I've gone for Wednesday Adams because she's not one. I have got a Wednesday Adams look like from my other Marcus Jones, I think it is, but I've not had one from Hannah Horror and it has the date on there. Now in my basket I have I have the rest of the um, Beetlejuice gang. That's what I'm going to get and a couple of other bits and pieces. So that is Hannah Horror guys. Thank you Hannah. Really do appreciate that. Um, sorry if you hear any screaming guys. I'm outside. <laughs> Zach's laughing. Um, this is going to be the most unprofessional video I have ever done on my journey of um, YouTube. <laughs> But guys, it is a nice day today and to be honest with you, my living room is just, there's no room for me to do this in my living room. Right guys, so this says fragile, it's quite a big parcel and it's Killstar. Strike me down. Um, because I'm doing um, gothic homeware decor in my um, kitchen, I thought I might as well finish off the Halloween decor by grabbing something from Killstar. I don't normally buy from Killstar for Halloween, to be honest with you. I normally stick to where I normally go, which is TK Maxx, um, Home Bargains, B&M, Sainsbury's, Asda, Argos, anywhere like that, that sell. Sains I did say Sainsbury's, don't I? Now, I'm still waiting for Sainsbury's Halloween range to come out. It's not come out yet, but I have grabbed a couple of things from Argos. I don't think they have anything else that I'm interested in 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 the halloween range i don't think but um i'm at Pen, penland as well and this year i went to one below and found some things in there as well but i am now officially done only things i want are from sainsbury's aldi and aldi are doing the nightmare for christmas squishmallow so me and zach want them <laughs> right so it's opened here i've got my information um I'm going to say I'll just throw that in the bin and just keep it here. So the well packaged guys, as you can see, they're wrapped with this, everybody's wrapping it with this recyclable paper and you know, I like it. I will re, in fact guys, I may not take this out, I may keep this as it is and re tape it back up, but I'll quickly show you what I grab for the purpose of this video. I'm not just going to show you it all packaged up and I have to check that none of it's broken anyway. So if any of it's broken, because it is all fragile, it'll have to go back. Um, we don't have an actual house as as of yet, although we've handed our notice in. We are going to live with our in-laws for a couple of weeks. And then from there, it's off to the south, near the sea, near the beach, we go. Right, first item, and it says haunted home wear, hand wash only, but it says it's microwavable safe. So not dishwasher safe, guys. Not that we're gonna have a dishwasher because we're leaving it here. Um, simply because the one that was here broke and we we replaced it with our own, but because we removed the one here, we have to keep it. It's only fair, unless Uncle said he didn't want it and we take it with us, but we're not really bothered because we've got a lot of stuff already that we're gonna bring with us. Okay, so my kitchen is gonna be skull and ghost theme. A little bit of pumpkin thrown in there. Oh my god. So I had to have this little guy. <laughs> He's so cute. I've also done um, Wilco's yesterday, so you will get to see that as well. So it's this cup that says strange and unusual, and it has a top with a ghost all around it. And as you can see, it's in perfect condition, not broken. This, guys, I can't remember what the price was for this. I can't remember what the price is, but I know they've got a 25% off lifestyle at the minute. But by the time this video goes up, chances are that will not be the case. But yeah, it's typical. I bought this and then they brought out to 25% on lifestyle. If I knew that, I would have waited and I could have got 25% off this order. But unfortunately, I didn't. This, it was, I'm sure it was under £10, guys, whatever it was. I will put the price somewhere around here so you can see. But yeah, I'm going to keep it in the box, guys. I'm not going to pull it out um, simply because what's the point when I'm moving? So I am going to wrap it back up. So the actual, there was more than this, this that I wanted, but you know, when you've got to say to yourself, you don't need it. I mean, I, I wanted this because I've never bought from 
kill star at Halloween and I've never seen I've never seen the the Halloween range and the fact that it's ghosties and I absolutely love ghosts this year even the band ghost I had to go for it right let's get the next item out if I can it's that guys let me just put it on the floor and I'll pull it out that way right so as you can see it's well packaged again with this stretchy I can't, I can't even tell you what this is it is like paper but it's very it's very durable and if you do rip like pull it it does rip dead easily but it does keep things intact all right there's no picture of what it is but i know what it is you know i ordered this and then afterwards i thought oh i don't really need it but now i've got it it'll come in handy for something in my kitchen you know there is a lot of things i store in my kitchen Right, I'm, oh, it's bigger than I expected. Okay, um, from what I can see, don't fall away from me, I need to. <laughs> right, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna take this part off, guys, because this is all wrapped up. So, as you can see, it is a scully, because my kitchen's gonna be skull, as well as my bedroom. But the house we're moving into next is only a temporary abode, so I don't want to make it too like my forever home because it's not going to be my forever home, it's just going to be a temporary abode. So some things I might not even bother pulling out, some things, depending on what size the kitchen is we're moving to, it's going to be a really a tiny galley kitchen, which I hate. I probably won't pull any of this out, but I won't know until we find that place. But here is is. And it just says sweets on front of it and it's a well you can put anything you want in there you don't have to put sweets in there you can put biscuits in there you could put a cooking item in there um what am i going to put in there oh. i don't actually know guys i think my son's trying to tell me that i'm boring i can hear him yawning that guys i can't remember what the price of that was either so i'll pop it up on the screen I did get some money off because I used my um, codes because one, I get the honey code and two, you get like your, your rewards and you can get money off by using your rewards. So I did use my rewards for that. Um, now I've got to try and get that back in there. Anyway, keep that. One more of that. Right, the last item guys. Oh my lord. Is this item um, a little bit of me wants to go and complete the set and get the other couple of items which are not that expensive so like 16 pounds um, and just grab them and, and then I've got them and that's the whole set so to speak so I might just do that in a minute so again it's this haunted homeware hand wash only microwavable safe and I've just realized guys I didn't put the polystyrene, so I'm going to put that there. I'm going to parcel it all back up when I go inside. That way, everything's being parceled the way it was. I don't want it getting broken. Because once these, once I've said that these are all okay, I can't turn around and say, oh, well, I've moved now and everything's broken. That's my responsibility. I hate polystyrene, guys, as a rule. Right, so last but not least, this, I had to get this, guys. There was no way in the world I was leaving this. Um, I can't really say what I grabbed from World Code, but it all kind of ties in. I've done it in a way that everything ties in. I really do apologise, guys, for the way I look today. <laughs> but I've got to be real. Um, makeup's just not on my agenda right now. One, because of the pain I'm in. Two, because of what I'm actually doing at the minute. I'm in the garden, out the garden, painting, decorating, packing. Right. And this is bigger than I expected. I am terrible when it comes to items. I always think it's either two, it's bigger or it's smaller. And it always ends up being either one or the other. But he is absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. Isn't he amazing? Zach, do you like him? No. You don't? No. He's a ghosty. Yeah, he's a ghosty. I mean, I love you, Mummy. Kiss me. Okay, okay. Kiss you in a minute. Mwah. Okay, guys, so this is a canister. Uh, I've got lots of canisters that I've bought from TK Maxx, which are the gull ones. This one, um, I might just keep for some kind. I might put rice in here because it'd be all right for rice. Or I might put some more pasta in there as pasta jar.
Sasha. I'll find, I'll find things to go in all of these canisters that I've got going on. But, I mean, he's, he's amazing. He's got kill star at the bottom, but I'm really chuffed with that. I'm a bit surprised that it's not wrapped up a bit better, guys, to be honest with you. But I do love it. So I'm going to put the polystyrene on that properly and put it back in the box. But it is complete. It's all okay. Um, price for that will be here. Now, they do have the dish. But I thought, well, when would I use the dish, really? I've got to think about things like that. Would I use it? Would it be just stuck in the cupboard? Um, or would I have it out on display? I'd maybe have a few things on it on display. So, yeah, maybe, maybe. And there is the cup as well to match it. So I've got a little bit of money left. I could grab the cup for the last thing and the dish. And they have the vase. That was it, the vase. The vase are still sold out. Now, if anything, I'd leave the dish because I don't really need the dish and I'd probably get the vase because I think the vase would look nice in the kitchen with nice, if I don't get real flowers, I'll get uh, official flowers and it'll still look nice. But well packaged, Kill Staff, thank you very much. I know that this is what TK Maxx should do with their parcels. Make sure that every item is polystyrene inside and bubble wrapped and it's got paper going all the way around this, guys, as well. I will have to take this one back out and put this polystyrene back in. So that is it for today, guys. Thanks to Hannah Horror, Hannah, for my order. Um, I will be back to order more when I'm probably settled in my home. Um, oh, it has the prices on here, guys. Okay, so the sweet ceramic jar, which was the black one with the school head on, was $17.49. Spooky mug with the lid on was $14.99. And the ghost hinge jar was $24.99. I did get money off that by using my discount code. So all in all, it was worth every bloody penny. And um, I'm gonna call this a wrap before we get blown away. So I know it's a bit different, guys. It might seem a little bit unprofessional today, but you know, we are real people we go through real life things and moving house is probably one of the most well it's in the top 10 as being one of the most stressful things to go through as well as pregnancy marriage funerals things like that so and it's all part of growing up so yeah we've lived in this house for nearly 10 years we've loved it we've made a lot of really good memories I don't think we've had many bad memories here, maybe a couple, but it's time to move on. This was Zach's first home. We brought him home as a newborn here. And yeah, it, it's sad in a way that we're moving, but it's time, ah! time to start our new journey. And um, yeah, hopefully it's gonna be a, a happy, successful one. All right, guys, take care. Happy Halloween, and I'll see you on my next one. Bye. Bye for now. Say bye bye, Zach. Bye. A plane above. See you next time. See you next time. <laughs> Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and hit that like button if you like this video because it helps me out and my channel. Take care, guys, and I'll see you on my next one. Bye for now.